Prince Harry has revealed what got him and wife, Meghan Markle, into trouble at the very start of their relationship. The couple, who became the Duke and Duchess of Sussex shortly after their wedding in 2018, met during the summer of 2016. One month on from his last interview with Stephen Goldbear, the 38-year-old returned for a surprise appearance on The Late Show with Stephen Goldbear on Tuesday. In the pre-recorded clip, the host asked Harry a series of questions, including if he had ever asked a celebrity for an autograph and what his favorite song is. The first question Mr. Colbert asked was what his favorite sandwich is, with Harry replying that he enjoyed a cheese and ham toasty with Dijon mustard on top cooked in a toasty machine. The host then asked him if he meant a panini press, the American way of saying it. Meghan and Harry's biographer hits out at King's cruel move to evict them from Frogmore Harry then explained, I have to be sort of careful with these questions because Americanisms to the Britishisms, it's very different. Got me and my wife into a little trouble at the beginning of our relationship. Colbert has asked these sorts of questions previously to a host of celebrities that have appeared on his talk show. On the show, Harry also opened up on the five words that would describe the rest of his life. Harry and Meghan want feel safe in UK as Sussex is given just weeks to vacate Frogmore the 38-year-old shared that the words he would use are freedom, happiness, clarity, space and love. The light-hearted segment comes just a month after his last appearance in front of a live audience. Harry appeared on the show to speak about his memoir, Spare, revealing the cathartic process of writing the book. On March 4, Prince Harry is holding a virtual live stream to promote his memoir, almost two months after its release. Prince Harry is set to sit down with Dr. Gabor Mate and will discuss the importance of healing and living life after having experienced a loss. Fans have been invited to ask for the Duke to answer on the live stream. Now, take